Gary Edwards has been a constant figure of South Coast racing in New South Wales for many years, through not only his success as a trainer, but also his tireless volunteer work at Greyhound tracks in the area. Gary has trained many winners over the years, but his current kennel star, Double Twist, may still yet turn out to be his best. So Gary, you've uh, lived down the south coast um, for quite a while at Nowra. How long have you been there? Uh, I've lived there since 1980. Uh, I was born and bred in Wollongong. Done all my uh, groundbreaking work in grand racing, uh, adapter, Wollongong, Bulleye. Um, and I believe you do a lot of uh, volunteer work at the Nowra Club? Yes, um, I do uh, lure driving on a Friday nights. I've uh, been a director for 10 years, president for three years, and uh, always willing to give a helping hand there. Any time the track gets usually washed away in heavy rain. Yeah. Now, were your family involved in greyhound racing? Yes, my family got involved in greyhound racing when I bought my first greyhound in 1974. Um, when she finished racing, my father bought uh, the other partners out and we bred with her. And uh, when did the greyhound racing bug hit you? Uh, when I was about 12 or 14, um, there was a chap up the road, the late Mr. Alan Webley. Uh, he trained greyhounds and I used to go up there every afternoon and uh, walk the greyhounds with him. Yeah. Now, how many dogs do you usually have in work and uh, how many do you currently have racing? Uh, usually, I've had up to about 10 or 12 in work. Uh, at the moment I've got uh, six in work, uh, but I try and keep it down to around about four. Four is, four is ideal for me. Now you've trained some very nice dogs in your career. What were some of your best dogs prior to your current star, Double Twist? Um, my best dog I had before that was, um, when I first started, was Miss Pinup. Um, she ran second in the Nationals staying race here at Wentworth Park. Um, we raced against a uh, uh, star title beat us that night, a short half head or a neck or something like that. It was a great thrill. Um, we had um, Malago Lad, a very fast dog, Baron Gary. Um, more space. Um, who else? Uh, young die. I'm a die. You know, good good dogs. And how do they rate uh, t alongside Double Twist? Um, well, there's only one that can probably match her. That's more space uh, in sheer brilliance and uh, able to put time on the board. You know, any time, any track. It's it, uh, there's not much between the two at all. Now it must have been a big thrill when Double Twist was invited to contest this year's Group One uh, Sporting Bet Megastar at Dapto. Yes, it was probably one of the pinnacles of my training career. Uh, even though we didn't win the race, uh, it was a great, great thrill just to be there and be nominated because she has had a great year. Now she's raced some of the best dogs in the state this year, and she's shown uh, she's shown that she's up there with them on ability. Uh, can she crack it for a group win? Well, I hope so. I hope, really hope so. Uh, she's a really good beginner. She hasn't got the early pace to the winning post for her, the first section, uh, but if she's in staying distance going down the back. She's very strong and uh, you know we can only keep our fingers crossed with the group one. Now Greyhound Racing has been a part of your life for a very long time and you've had a lot of success. Uh, is there one thing that you'd like to achieve in the sport? Uh, oh, probably to win a group one, anything. But uh, I'm happy, quite happy to keep winning races at Wetwell Park, um, travel a little bit, I'm happy to go up to uh, Gosford this, this, this month in December, the Gold, Cup, uh, Gold, Gold Cup up there. Um, apart from that, just keep racing in Wetwell Park and uh, keep winning races. 